up, y'all? Hey, this uh past week we had a bunch of comedy shows that featured some other comedians. There's me, myself, Marquise Moore, James, JB Buchanan, and Nicholas Kuvar. We had a project we created called One Life to Live Comedy Run. And all of us are cool. But none of us really knew each other just like that, except for me and Marquise. You know, we've been friends for two years. I met Nick in the last few years. A stand-up comedian, very funny. Nobody's perfect. But he's a good dude. And the significance about Nick is he loves stand-up comedy. Like he loves it a lot. Probably more so than almost anybody that I know. This guy is serious about being a better uh, human being and stand-up comedian. Now, what it is about Nick, he kind of got me a little choked up when I think about it is, Nick is blind. He can't see. He has to completely depend upon other people to get around. Now, he don't completely like to do this straight. Self-sufficient as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Like, this dude got muscles and shit. Motherfucker be doing push-ups and crunches. And uh I watched this dude maneuver with barely any use of his eyes. Like he's not completely blind, but from my understanding, he's damn near like 95% of the way. Like he it's a it's only a matter of time before he's one percent blind. Like he wouldn't be able to see anything at all. And you know you realize how oh, shit I take for granted my ability to see. You know, I get to go over here, go over there, and if he's in an environment where he's not accustomed to what's going on, he has to trust the people around him that they'll look out for. Or sometimes he'll be like sitting there, we we go mingle with things of that nature. And now because we like say fuck Nick, it's, it's like we can't just be like, oh shit, where's Dick? You know what I'm saying? He's sitting there, he can see, he can feel, he can do everything. I'm like, I have no idea what the fuck he has going on inside of him. Like, here we go, he's performing on various stages in various cities. He doesn't even know that the audience, or he can hear that they're laughing, but he don't, he can't see. He can't see the stage. He can't see the building. <laughs> he can't see the faces. And he's just carrying himself like it don't matter. And there's people out here who has all of their senses. They got all the goddamn common sense, but they got all of their senses. And they are not even willing to attempt to follow their dreams. This man did not know me when I asked him, would you be willing to ride with me across the state to the different cities? and put together these shows. It's people with eyes who can see, who can drive, who can all that, who's not willing to get in the car and go follow their dreams. This man was killing it. All of us were doing our thing. You know what I'm saying? This man was doing it, for real, for real. And uh, I just wanna say I'm proud of him. I feel sorry for him, but that ain't what he in it for, you know? But by being around him uh, these, these past few days It helped me to become a better person You know what I'm saying I mean You know who you guys ain't shit You know what I'm saying But overall Shout out to Nicholas Kuvar James J.B. Buchanan uh, Marquise Moore More like to live comedy run man It was a blessing Love y'all man